Youthful Sunday CCF. We're here with another CCF Sunday's fast track with this very energized, youthful pastor, Pastor Marty Ukaya, who I call my kuis. Yes, we're looking into different characters in the Bible who've experienced brokenness but really saw it as a blessing where God blessed this brokenness. And we just have a few questions for you. And when you're talking about Elijah uh, and about cooperation, the first question that came into mind is, in determining our cooperation to God, how will we know if God is instructing us or if we are just feeling it? Of course, the clearest way is in His Word, right? That's why we have His Word. He will reveal His will there. And uh, sometimes it's, if it's a gray area in His Word, you don't see it there. Well, you have godly authorities like of course your parents if you're still single you have uh, pastors who, who can advise you in certain areas that it seems not clear but definitely um, it will be aligned to his word so that's why you go to his word first and then to godly authorities feelings are sometimes hard to manage how do you choose to align our hearts with God moment by moment? Well, it's really intimacy with the Lord. Uh, nothing beats that. We need to spend time with God. We need to read His Word. Just like in the story of Elijah, he went in this 40 days and 40 night journey from Beersheba to Mount Horeb just so that he can encounter God more. And the more we encounter God, the more He aligns our heart to Him. And what do you personally do when you experience brokenness in your life? So we, you shared earlier in your, in your message that you were experiencing some health issues, but praise God that you're here this, this morning. What are some of your disciplines to always be dependent on God, not to lose focus and cooperate with Him? Well, of course, one is we spend time, quality time with the Lord every single day. Mm -hmm. You read His Word, spend time with Him. Second is, of course, you need to serve Him as well. Because a lot of people, yeah, they're... They're okay now when they're, when they're spending time with the Lord. But the overflow of our intimacy with God is we serve Him. Because the more we serve Him, the more that He uses us for His glory. So that's one of my disciplines. And of course, prayer time with my family as well. Accountability with small group, with my small group leader who can mentor me. Because the truth is we need people who can help us improve in our relationship with God and also who can help us deal with our brokenness. What is your encouragement to someone who is experiencing brokenness after brokenness for them to press on and cooperate with God? Well, if you're that person, please don't give up. God loves you dearly. He wants to give you strength. He wants to deal with you graciously. He wants to pour out His grace in your life. And you might be depressed. You might be discouraged. There are people here in CCF, maybe in your satellite or wherever you are uh, as you watch this. We also have an online ministry. We want to help you. And God is ready, always ready, to give you comfort. So please, don't give up. Thank there you have it, Pastor Marty. Catch more videos about our